A fire in Quarryville, Local 12's Megan Moore is live on the scene. Megan, what can you tell us is happening? Good morning, and um, I am here with District Chief Lou Arnold. And uh, so this happened around 6 o'clock. We're here on Seminole Street uh, near University. Uh, you were saying that when crews got here, they actually weren't dispatched. Correct. They were dispatched to uh, an alarm drop just 200 yards down the street for the hotel. So their smoke detectors actually picked up the smoke. They picked it up, and on their way back, they discovered uh, a lot of smoke in the area. Okay. And uh, the basement was fully involved in this house. Uh, the good thing that you were saying, this building right behind us here is where that fire started. You said it, it's, it's a vacant building. It is a vacant building, but the, it, it's obvious there were squatters in there okay. on and off. Um, you said crews will be here a little while longer. The floor also collapsed, so crews aren't allowed to necessarily go inside just yet. Correct. First floor into the basement, it, it collapsed uh, due to the heavy fire involvement. And uh, we, we've got them excluded from going in the basement in the majority of the first floor. So we're, we're, we're trying to put out all the pockets of fire. Thank you so much for talking with us this morning. The most important part is uh, that you said nobody was hurt. So Correct. That's good. All right, Perry, I'll send it back.